in a previous video I was down below where I'm standing now showing you a little rest park area and I'm now basically I've just come out of the Bank of America Tower where I've had a subway and I'm now returning towards the town centre campus of the Faculty of Business and Economics at the University of Hong Kong which is located conveniently just nearby here in between Admiralty and Central District right in the middle of Hong Kong and the campus name is Town Centre because it really is slap bang in the middle of the town centre of the city so why am I making a video of me walking around I just thought it's interesting because I'm on a walkway and what you can see is there's lots of there well maybe you can't see it so well but there are many interconnected walkways you can see some in the distance there which allow pedestrians to walk above street level and these walkways connect various designer shopping malls uh, business centers office buildings and so on so i thought it might be an interesting route to film as i walk from the as I say, the Bank of America Tower, just outside the Bank of America Tower, along this uh, walkway, pedestrianised walkway. You can see a little park down there, these little small parks which just give some respite to the, uh, the very busy people here in Hong Kong, especially in this area. Uh, so I'll just show you a bit of the architecture, some of the buildings. Here you can see buses, you can just hear a uh, tram tooting and ringing its bell there and some of these sort of Hong Kong towers of high finance in uh, and around this area and uh, so just continuing along this walkway I may need to alight from the walkway soon but uh, as I say I'm just heading towards Admiralty and let's just make sure that's right so we've got here is a sign Hong Kong Park Peak Tram Citibank Tower it's not quite as helpful as I might like so I'm gonna go down and start getting en route so Queens Road Central it says down here so that, since I'm going to Queensway Plaza I expect I probably need to be on the Queens Road in order to be going in the right direction to where I'm headed at this moment and I would just like to continue this video so I go down this slightly darker stairwell carefully mind and have a look up this road here look down here and I'm going to take a left I've got to be quick though because that, that beeping sound means that the green man is showing and he's just started flashing so that means I need to hurry up and cross the road before the cars start mowing me down. Okay, so the Cheong Kong Centre over here on the left. Some uh, flowery garden. Not quite as exquisite as the feng shui around the Bank of China building, which I mentioned in an earlier video. Not sure what this building over here is, but it, it looks quite British, doesn't it? With the, well, quite European anyway with those Roman columns and the sort of dome-esque, the uh, sort of dome with a little spire on the top. So, where am I now? I wonder. Well, soon find out. Okay, so we've got a car park here and I think that that those lights in the distance, I think, are Devo, possibly Devo Road, which are a road which is very central in Hong Kong. I could be completely wrong, though. Um, now, what I'm now looking for is this little red sign, which looks like a little white beetle. On a, on a red background, which is the sign in Hong Kong for the, I think they call it Dai Tie, or Dai Tie. In uh, Mandarin, it's Di Tie, which uh, is the underground 
known locally as the MTR or Metro and the I must say that the Metro in Hong Kong is extremely uh, easy to navigate it's uh, it's not it's not quite like the London underground where you could end up walking for sort of hundreds of meters to get to your next train it tends to be when you get to an interchange you just cross over to the opposite platform and then you're on the new line which is quite convenient but then having said that it's nowhere near as complex as the London underground so but anyway a standard chartered building there sun's just going down so we're getting a little bit darker as we move along and we'll just continue along street really overshadowed now by these beer moth monsters, monster buildings. And so just continue on. YouTube will allow me to upload up to 10 minutes of footage, so I might as well continue on my journey with you. There's a Gucci. Now, those who know Hong Kong will probably be thinking, why on earth am I going this way? In fact, I'm so impatient I can't even wait for that green man. I'm going to cross over here. Now, Ice House Street. I've seen that in my rough guide, but I don't know precisely how it's going to connect me to where I want to be. So I might have to ask somebody where we are in a minute. So if you're ready for some Cantonese, I will try to ask somebody something. Chengman, Xinjiang, Nega Queensway Plaza, Hai Bindo. Queensway Plaza? Hey, Versace. I actually have no idea. Sorry. Admiralty de Pangbian. Admiralty de Pangbian. Queensway Plaza. Oh, Tia Bina. Near Central, actually. Yeah, no, you, you, you have to go to you have to go to MOT. MOT. Yes. Then you take off it. I I go to. So how do I walk to Central? Um, there is the I mean, MOT. Over there. MOT. You want to walk to MOT? Just generally, hi hi ma hi gao dao ah. Ah, hi gao bing. Sikwa. Hi gao bing. Hey, maybe hi so hi. Can't you think you hi so hi? Okay, Dorje. Thanks very much. Hi. Bye. Okay, so they didn't really know where I was supposed to go. They sent me off in a direction, the opposite way to the direction I thought I was going, which means I'm going to have to leave you without having re reached my destination. Such is life in a brand new city, which I don't know. So, well, I'm going to reach my objective, but I'm going to have to leave you behind on this occasion. But I'll come and pick you up later when we have another of these riveting videos. Bye.